Hey there, it is me, Cecilia Morris, your engineer by education and your home business owner by desire. And today I'm coming to you with Life Skills for Business Day 8. And Day 8's topic is on procrastination and how procrastination is killing your business. So, for those who don't know me, my name is Cecilia Morris, and yes, I am a degreed engineer, but I have been in the network marketing arena for over 10 years. I enjoy this um, job, so to speak, because it allows me to have a second income without having a second boss. And also, I get to meet some really cool people along the way, and last August 2016, I started internet and social media marketing, and I have met some phenomenal people, as well as done some amazing things for the growth of my business. So, with that being said, Said, let's talk life skills for business day eight and today's eight topic is on procrastination and how it is killing your business so when you think about procrastination most of the time the reason why people procrastinate is because the job or task that they have to do is something that they don't want to do and in business you don't get to pick and choose if you don't take action guess what your business is not going anywhere so attached to this video will be a blog um, on let's Let's see, I think I've got two out there, how to have more fun and get things done, or maybe the one on how to get more done in 90 minutes than most do in a week. So I'll pick which one of those, but it will help you get organized and get focused and get out of the procrastination trap. So think about those things that you are not doing for your business that you should be doing. For one, live videos. Live videos get more exposure on Facebook than any other medium that they've got going on right now. And don't do a video on YouTube and then transfer it to Facebook. You want to go live on Facebook to get more exposure. Or maybe it's a blog post that you need to write because you don't know what you want to write about or you don't think that you're a good writer. Well, you don't have to be a good writer. Nobody's going for the Pulitzer Prize here, people. We are just sharing information. So pick a topic. If you're having trouble finding a topic, go out there onto different... Um, um, websites that are in your target market and find out what people are talking about. What are they asking about? What do they want to know about? And then write about that. Or if you're having a problem or you're struggling in your business, go do some research on the internet on that thing that you're struggling with. And then you write an article and put that out there about that particular topic. Um, some other things that you could be procrastinating about. It might be... Um, joining a team where you can get trained. For instance, I've got a group that I'm with right now and it is $1 to get started. And it amazes me how many people fret over that one dollar i mean like seriously so if it's you getting training so that way you can be better at building your brand and business online well guess what you're gonna have to invest in yourself and if you're interested in the one dollar program that i have i will include that link with this video so that way you can get started getting the training you need to take your business forward most importantly is just stop procrastinating do something doing nothing will keep you where you always are doing something will at least get you somewhere if you do something and you get positive results, then you just achieve something. If you do something and you get negative results, you still achieve something because now you know what not to do. So with that being said, stop procrastinating. It is killing your business. Click the links that I'm going to attach this video so that way you can learn how to be more productive, how you can get out of procrastination mode, and you can start doing things that are going to move your business forward. Once again, I am Cecilia, your engineer by education and your home business owner by desire.